Ready to learn how to do your hair with a wand? I'm Renee Matt, and I'm gonna show you exactly how I did this. I'm gonna start with some dry shampoo and spray it in at the roots. Then just rub it in really good with the pads of your fingers until it's not feeling cool anymore. And then I'm gonna spritz in a thermal spray. This is got a heat protectant. Section it off and we're gonna start with the back. Take a small chunk, twist it around your finger, and wrap it around a wand. You're gonna hold it for a few seconds, you're gonna cup it in your hand, and then you're gonna let it down gently and continue wrapping towards the front of your face, moving forward as you go, always wrapping towards the back of your head. See how I'm cupping it to let it cool a little bit? And then gently bring it down. We're gonna start with the other side, always wrapping it towards the back, away from your face, moving across your head. Bring down the next section. I'm always doing my sections um, kind of how they lay on my head. And then I'm taking about one square inch of hair across my head. Depending on the thickness of your hair, you're gonna to wanna to take either a smaller section or maybe even a larger section. It's also gonna depend on how you want this to lay. If you want a lot more curls and body, you're gonna to wanna to do smaller sections. If you want more of just a wave and a loose curl, you could do larger sections. Just know that they probably won't hold as long throughout the day, depending on your hair type and the products you use. So you can play around with it and see what works best for you. So continue all the way up to the top. Again, like I said, I do it the way that my hair lays. So as you see, I'm gonna continue doing it where my part lays. When you get to the front, you always wanna do it kind of to the side and straight down so that it really like gives a nice swoop away from your face. Once you're done curling, you're gonna wanna let it cool completely. Nice graze there. And then uh, once it cools completely, you're gonna wanna just bring your fingers through it. And here's a trick for you. I have a volume. It is amazing. And this is not sped up for this little section here. You just put it in, clamp it a second or two, and that is it. Move it around and then go down. I do it down both sides of my head. I also do it across the back. You just let it cool and it gives so much volume without any backcombing. It's pretty amazing. I do have a link for all of these um, products in my link in my bio and I will also put them in the caption. Just gonna brush it through and then comb out that volume, the crimping in the volume and then I actually brush out my curls sometimes just so they are more of a large wave rather than curly. I'll finish off with some serum. This is gonna help smooth those ends and make it look shiny and glossy. You always wanna start at the ends and then work up towards your scalp. You never wanna start at your scalp with a hair serum. And that is it. Style it the way you want to finish it off. Spritz in a little bit of hairspray if you want to, and you're good to go. Thanks for watching and follow for more beauty tutorials.